Deuteronomy 22:28 Ki yimsa ish naara vetula asher lo orosa u tefasa ve shachavima ve nimsau Today we begin a new section in Deuteronomy that's related, but still a new section, and we start with the key, as we've seen before. This key is an if, so we're setting up another hypothetical situation. If a man, here the subject, finds a young woman a virgin. So these here go together. So if the if a man finds a young virgin, come back here and get the verb, call imperfect third masculine singular of the verbal root matzah. If a man finds a young virgin woman who is not betrothed. And so again, a new section, but related. Uh, this one is not betrothed. Here we have uh, a pu'al perfect, third feminine singular. The verbal root here is still aras, and notice that the, the pu'al kibbutz gets lengthened because the dagesh will reject from the resh r2, so we get lengthening to that ou vowel class long vowel. So is not betrothed, this young girl is not betrothed, and he seizes her. Here, the third feminine singular pronominal suffix is who is seized. The verb here is a call perfect third masculine singular of the verbal root tafas, and he seizes her. Now, this vekatal form follows from the generic present here of the, the generic situation. A man finds and seizes her, and then here's another one that follows from this, and he lays with her. Call perfect third masculine singular of the root shachav this time, and he lays with her. Here's another one, and not he, but they. Notice there, they are found, and notice are found. You get that passive voice because now we have a nifal perfect third common plural of the verbal root matzah. So if a man finds a young virgin woman who is not betrothed and he seizes her and lays with her and they are found, and then we'll get the rest of it in tomorrow's video.